Welcome back to Alistair Davis Golf. Today's video is all about how to stop hanging back in the golf swing through impact. And this is a request from Dave. So Dave, hopefully this helps you. I'm gonna show you a drill that's gonna help you stop hanging back through impact. Just to be clear, what hanging back is through impact, and I have to stand into this station here, is basically our upper torso moving backwards through impact, meaning that we're gonna hit the ground prior to impact. So our low point is gonna be before the golf ball. So we're gonna get a lot of duff shots, a lot of top shots, a lot of high elevation in our shots. So, you know, we're really gonna increase that dynamic loft through impact. So not desirable at all for power or contact. So today's drill, quite simply, is I've got an alignment rod sticking out my bag with my foam, foam ball on. And the idea is here really, when I go and hit the golf ball, if I hang back, I'm gonna make contact with my head and the foam ball. So what I wanna be able to do is make some swings where my head stays in front of that foam ball, stays pretty, pretty centered then from there, and then swing through and then slowly goes forward towards the target. I don't want the head to go massively forward, but I definitely don't want it to go backwards. The only club I'd be happy with it going backwards would be a driver. So let's just take my setup to a ball. Make a practice swing here, top of the back swing, swing down, trying to keep my head sort of centered. And then from there, I'm going to push forward a little bit without going massively forward, as I've already said. So then the next test is to hit a golf ball doing exactly that. I'd recommend starting slightly underpowered. So there we have it. Successfully didn't hit the ball. Good contact, didn't hit it full power, but I definitely didn't hit the golf ball, the foam ball. So that would be the drill, Dave. Hopefully you can have a go with that. It's quite difficult, you know, fiddly to set up, but stick a rod, you can do it from the ground with a bigger rod if you wanted to. Don't have to have the foam ball on. An alignment rod next to your head, or get someone standing far enough away holding the club behind your head. Make sure it's safe to do so though, obviously, and hit some shots. It's all about, again, stopping the torso going back through impact. Again, think about where your weight would be going if you're throwing a ball doing this. It'll all be going away from target, which is definitely not what we want to see. Definitely want to see the weight kind of centering and moving slightly towards the lead foot, a contact, pushing forward even more, and then the upper body slightly going forward towards target after, compact, on, co after contact. So Dave, hopefully that's helped you. For the rest of you, if you've enjoyed the video, please click like down below, it really helps my channel grow. Also chat like Dave did, send some questions, send some requests, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can with the video. Also, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. Help Helps my channel grow, obviously, and it, you can join our journey and see all the content I produce three times a week. Just hit my logo down by here, and it'd be great to have you on board. Thank you for watching.